In this tutorial, we will guide you on how to save files in Excel using VBA. Here we have a workbook with data entered regarding the inventory. Now let's save the file in the D drive in a folder named Inventory. So let's start by double-clicking on the Sheet 1 module, selecting Worksheet from the Object drop-down list, and choosing Before Double-Click for the Event Handler. We will begin by assigning variables for the path and the file name as strings. Now we will define the path of the Inventory folder, which is located in the D drive. Since we're trying to automate the process, let's write a line of code which will automatically set the file name, instead of prompting us for suggestions. Over here, we want the data in cell A1 to be kept as the file name by using the range of cell A1. For that, we have mentioned the range over here. Next, we will use the active sheet .save, as property and define the file name, path, file extension, and file format over here. For the path, notice that we have simply called upon the variable that was used to store the location before. Now let's go back to the Excel sheet and double-click anywhere on the sheet. Great! The code worked without giving any errors. Now if we access the location mentioned in the path variable, you will notice that an Excel file is present over here, with the same file name which was present in cell A1. That means the file has been saved successfully in Excel using VBA. Thanks for watching. This was a HowTech.TV tutorial.